What was your family like? Um, very, very loving from the beginning. They're very big on getting you to speak and um, a asking you questions about yourself, where you're from, because they, they don't travel that much. You know, they've never been on a plane before. They've never gone to the U.S., whereas, you know, we're, you know, the U.S., I came here and whatnot. And it's just really different. They really want to know what it's like where you come from, but they really want to share where they come from and how they live and what they do here. Is um, my homestay family, when I got here, immediately welcomed me with open arms. Um, my mom unpacked all my stuff and she made sure that I had everything that I needed. She asked me what I liked to eat. She gave me coffee three times a day. Mm -hmm. um, everything was great. Uh, my homestay, homestay family was really awesome. They were so incredibly welcoming. Um, I came into it really not sure about um, how confident I was in my Spanish, but even though I'm almost positive at least two of them speak English fluently, they refused to say anything to me in Spanish or in English. We got like the language barrier really was not an issue. Um, communication was sometimes a little hairy, but we never any big issues. They never teased me about my mistakes. It was just very. Um, easy welcoming experience. I really like I'm really 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 gonna miss my homestay family. That might be the thing I miss most about this trip. Oh, I've had a great experience, especially with the host family. Uh, all the different difference in the cultures from uh, American to Costa Rican life is it's really amazing. The oneness of the families, how connected they are and like like every evening we go over to uh, the house beside us which would be the the dad's family sister with the Tio and uh, we go over there and we talk for a couple hours, just sit there and talk about each other's day and how we've been, and it's really, really cool. Um, they're all very nice and very accommodating, and I love my family, and without them, I don't think I could make it through the time. But at the same time, there are things that, you know, kind of annoy you. The toilet paper is always annoying, at least to me, where you have to put it in a little trash can instead of down the toilet like we all do in the United States and so that that is definitely more difficult to remember um, while I like beans and rice and we eat them at home it does get tiring after a while I mean I've never had beans and rice for breakfast before but that's pretty much all I have for breakfast now I've had a lot of fun with my homestay family. My sisters, um, my homestay sisters have taken me to a lot of shops and just shopping with my homestay sisters has been a lot of fun. So they've been, they've made me try all the weirdest looking fruits you've ever ima you can ima imagine. The world is a big family and we all need to respect each other and treat each other like family. Like my host family treated me like, their, my mom treated me like her daughter and my sister treated me like her sister. And if the whole world could be like that, then it would be a perfect world. And I'm just really sad to be leaving because I feel like this is my home now. And I'm really going to miss it.